Hello and hi. In this video, you will learn how to place various components like the furniture components, the specialty equipments, lighting fixtures or any other equipments or fixtures inside a building model specifically for the architecture. The components are basically the families defined by Revit under the family categories different categories in the family. So it can be a furniture component, it can be an equipment or a kitchen equipment or a kitchen component, it can be a plumbing component, it can be a sanitary component, so there can be various components. So when you place these components in Revit project, you need to see that the components are placed posted in a floor or in a work plane or in a wall or in a ceiling. So there are various types of components based on where they are hosted. Now we will learn various types of components that can be placed and various host in which it can be placed. Now let's begin. So in this particular plan, you can see that we are in the ground floor plan. Now we will be placing some components over here based on the requirements that we have in the architectural model. So let's see how we can place a component. So in the insert, there is a load family. Now, in the previous sections, we have seen that how the families can be loaded. Now, again, to repeat, the families in Revit can be loaded by either by load family, which is directly loaded in the uh, computer, that is in the uh, disk of your computer, and you can retrieve from the particular folder where it's saved. And there is another option like load Autodesk family that is directly you can load the family from the Autodesk cloud. Now let's look into the cloud and see how we can load. So we go to the load Autodesk family dialog box and go with the all results. So here we can see that there is a category called furniture. So there are various furnitures that you can see. Let's say if I wanted to have some furnitures like let's say I wanted to have a furniture desk let's say so I select them and let's say I wanted to have a furniture chair furniture cabin fire furniture bookshelf and let's say a cabinet and look now under the furniture category you will see that these families are now loaded into the project. Now how would you bring these families in the project? Well let's see. Under the furniture category here in the project browser, let's check. So you have the bookshelf. Now what you can do is directly you can expand it, take the particular type, right click and then you can say create instance. You can directly take it to the Revit now there's a flip option we will see how I'm using the space key in order to change the orientation I want to have a reception desk over here so click right there is basically a type over here create instance let's say I wanted to have the reception desk at this particular part I wanted to have some cabinet in the reception cabinet right click create instance I can get the cabinet let's say yeah. now with this you can see that these are various models that are placed and now you want to see with the 3d view so in the 3d view you can so here is the floor that has to be hide so I hide this floor and you can see that the furnitures are placed so I'm just giving some shade with the shadow on now you can see so now these furnitures are components so now let's say how we can download this comp uh, you know how you can insert this with a component tool so in the architecture you have a component place a component now you can see the same thing over here but there is basically the type properties dialog box you can see uh, type properties uh, drop down you can see that there is various types so you can place this at the locations that you want so if you want to change the properties of it, so there's a level 
there's an elevation and then there's an edit type you can change the material similarly you can select the object go to the type properties and change the materials here now let's say if I wanted to have some plumbing components let's say I wanted to have a plumbing component at this particular part go to the insert load family now I am going from the library in my folder I go to the plumbing and in the plumbing I have this architectural folder and in the picture I have a WC and here I go so if I wanted to have the WC here the water closet there is a component I can see the water closet placed now this is a wall posted component so it will ask for a wall partition here let me change it to generic wall so again, now you can see in the 3D view how this furniture is placed so I am just going to reduce the height of the walls to let's say 1 here we are. so this is way how I can place the components various components are there and they have various detail levels and more about the detail levels we will be discussing in another video of the series. Thank you and keep watching our videos.